Hello and welcome back to Snowrunner and our hard mode series for what I believe to be day 43, I think. Not that we really count the days, but I think it's episode 43, so I think that's how it's working. Uh, we are picking up where we left off last time, which is parked up by our messy trailers, as we are looking to get ready for the cement deliveries and the super order all in one go. I know it's slightly, slightly ambitious of me. Yeah, do you think our angles will go out here? A little bit. I'll go out a little bit. I'll do. Right. My <laughs> me crane's not working at all today. What is going on? What is this all about? Bear with me. Okay, let's try that. I have decided to unplug my wheel and side panel because it appears to be causing more issues every time. Alright, crane's working at least. It looks like it's struggling. Now hopefully my audio and everything is alright because I unplugged the wrong things a few times. And I won't know until we go ahead. So it's service parts on this trailer. That should be alright. And then if we we'll put vehicle spare parts on this one. Which I think will be alright just. do it this way. I don't think we need to get a anchor out, really. So then this is ready to uh, go through to Black River at some point. Yeah, what am I doing? There we go, packing everything away. Lovely. So then I want to get some more fuel in here. It's right throw me now. Get some more fuel in here. And it doesn't take a lot to throw me. I think we've been chatting about that the last few episodes. It does not take a lot. And then two more cement pallets and then this will be ready to head to Drummond Island we'll bring the uh, White Western and that can then do the logistics based delivery the White Western will then be ready to do we'll bring it back and then that will be ready to do the Island Lakes delivery. And then along with what we do in Drummond and then um, Black River, all those cargo deliveries will be done and we'll be on to login. Now, that said, it does, does not mean it's going to happen all today going to do my best but, but with things not working already and you know lord knows why praise the baby jesus can we have some luck please um i haven't got a clue i haven't got a clue why i haven't got a clue why the, why this game that i love so much hates me so much now i <laughs> i haven't been out of the game couple of episodes, I left it on pause again and came back a little bit later in today. So this is the third, third episode being recorded in the same day. This is unprecedented. Lord knows when I have the time to edit them, render them and upload them, but we, we're getting them. At least if they're recorded, that's, that's one thing. But that does mean 
for over three hours now. None of the terrain has had a chance to reset. And, you know, we've, we've rolled, we've dug some holes, we've got stuck. Churn some bits up. So I'm thinking I might have to take these the long route rather than trying to go up and down through the shortcuts. I think I've I've, I've knackered them. Luckily, at the, at the last sort of time that we really need them, and they've had it. I forgot to fuel up. Why do I do it to myself? Why do I do it to myself? Honestly, it's insanity. It really is. I think 40 leads is going to get me out of the quarry. Oh, we'll see. I was too busy chatting about how well things were going and what we were going to do. <laughs> Concentrating on what he needed to do. Son. Just need this climb to go as smooth as possible. We have churned this out so bad. Come on. <laughs> Seventeen liters. Can we get to the fuel tank? <laughs> Madness. Again, going back over our own steps, or our own tracks, as it were.
think, if I can. Can I get two? No. Obviously, we don't need to take... Because we can't actually deliver the other bits in Drummond yet until we've done the logistics base, we might as well try and do that first. Again, we do have other fuel. We do, we do. Anyway, uh, thank you for returning. Those are our returning viewers, and if you are new here, be sure to go and check out the disaster that has been this entire series. I feel like we're very unstable. I bet there is so much wrong with this. No, there isn't. I was just saying that there's so much wrong with this truck, but it's not as bad as I was expecting. It just felt a little bit, a bit slippy slidey. Can't lie. So once we do the logistics phase drop off, all the other drop offs open up, and we can just go out and. Uh, do whatever you want, <laughs> to, to a degree. So we want to attach, oh no. Attach now, yes we can. Oh, don't knock anything off. That'd be right, pain in the bum. Let's pack our cargo. So let's just, again, let's just check. We want fuel on there, consumables on there, wood and spare service parts, off we go. So now we're going to go... Get stuck in the mud. Why wouldn't I? Trying to avoid the uh, tree stumps now this time. Didn't really acknowledge it last time when we hit the tree stump, but <laughs> luckily I was able to pull myself through with sheer brute power. Now I believe that this trailer that is sitting here is almost full. I know we only just filled up, but we've got a long way to go and a long way to come back without any fuel on route. So we're going to grab a little bit here as well. Some funny camera angles, I do apologise. You know, if need be, we'll shoot across the river <laughs> so confidently. We'll shoot across the river with the Land Rover, we'll come over the uh, shortcut across with fuel, if need be. We probably will need be, but, you know. Wishful thinking and all that. A 
bit light on the front, aren't we? I haven't even gone that way yet. It's just quite risky. I think we'll take it. We'll do that one because that is just unnecessarily long to do that. We're going to take this up. We're going to... Hmm. Okay, we're going to do it. We'll just be really cautious with it. Should be pretty stable because we've got obviously the trailer on the back. Normally, when I've gone those that route and the other sort of high route is over that way, it's been with a two slot flatbed and then a trailer being pulled behind. Whereas, obviously, we've got a lot of weight here, we've got the stability with it being a longer trailer. We've got the White Western Star, so you know. It's a good truck. It knows what it's doing. The question is do I? Do I know what I'm doing? Clearly not, so I'm having to check directions. Yeah, it's that one. See now, on stream, when we did this, we went through these trees and up and over, I think. We're not going to do that. We'll go, we'll go round. Yeah. Oh, it's just so tempting, because you can see it's just cut out, ready, but... Oh... Even up through there. We went up over there. And we have to play it safe. We've had too many incidents. We've got to play it safe. home stretch of the regular deliveries also oh, it's just these four trailers five trailers there's two in um, Drummond and then it's logs I mean logs are going to take a while but you know that's the home stretch we can really start to get excited about Alaska once we once we get logging
so you don't need to sort of sneak through up there. Now, the issue with this one comes sort of around here. Things sometimes get a little bit leany. Is that what I mean? Easy make it. <laughs> Nothing to worry about. Just, just double checking now that we've arrived. I like double check that we've got everything we need. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Beautiful. And now we've opened up Island Lake. So we can leave this one here, I think. I think I'd, I'd rather take this, because if we've got to do the... Oh, there's those other jobs that require a little bit of something, and one of them requires three. So this one we're going to take back. Surprised it didn't pop a wheel. <clears throat> See, I'd rather have this one rock and roll around on the back rather than the than just the uh, the flatbed one. because of the way I drive. That's how easy that route is that I was concerned about, but going up and over with the load. <laughs> you know, we still had that bit at the end, but it's just a little bit quicker. So, you know, I thought after the logistics it opened up the rest of them to do as you please, but it seems it's not. But that's okay. Because I probably would have done Island Lake next anyway. Island Lake. I'd like to do Island Lake Drummond and then Black River.
so I need to start thinking about where I want to put my last few fuel trailers out on the map for logging. Probably do a lot of Kodiak with some fuel in, preferably full. At wherever I'm logging. So I'm going to have a truck there loading logs and also um, refueling the P16 when it gets back. And we want some, I should imagine, at each map entrance. Coming out of Smithsville because we should be able to get into Smithsville. We can park the scout with some fuel. Yeah, so though we've built, built, got, built up a little bit of momentum, I do still need to have a little bit of time. Obviously, re replanning and re replacing some of this stuff. Stuff, mate. Stuff. Let's get our lights on. And then this one is our Island Lake trailer. Beautiful. Right, so then in Island Lake we also have, this is going to the log station, and I think the cement is also, uh, oh it's going to the lumber mills, let's go a little bit further, but oh, that's fine. Standard Mr. Farquhar 37 point manoeuvre with a with a roll truck at the end. shift on.
it's difficult. I get a little bit excited, and I shouldn't because in my head I'm telling myself, oh, this is it. It's near the end of Michigan. It's near the end of Michigan. Probably still another 12 episodes in Michigan, at least. <laughs> It's just that these are the. This is like the, the last big order. That's what, that's what it unlocks right at the end. It is the last big order that we've, you know, we've saved our logins to that. That's our last big order. Do I want to go down there or along there? Uh, we'll go down here. That is the way that we should go. Before I head down though, there's a knock at the door, so bear with me. Alright, sorry about that. Hopefully. Ah. It's gonna be too steep. Perfect. Let's see if we can at least get the uh, the first lot of goods dropped off before we have to switch it to a new day. Sometimes it takes forever to get through this swampy bit. And we've got a fair old bit of cargo on the back. All five slots, two cement, cement bricks. Consumables. There's a bit of weight there. We're going to be getting the winch out, that's for certain, so hopefully it's going to work for us. I think the White Western needs a little bit more TLC than just some replacement shoes. Although it's not really showing up as a lot of damage. Maybe the uh, accumulation of lost a little bit of damage causing that struggle. Try to find the path of least resistance.
come on. Yeah, I'm hoping we don't get any more interruptions or have to pause anymore. Pause. I'm hoping to uh, live stream ATS straight after this. Cut my time close by trying to fit in the extra boarding. Making progress, and you know what? We need to we need to make more progress, and just getting uploaded and getting it out, and, and what have you. Not just me progressing, but the series progressing as well. That's what we need. Now, I've never tried it yet. I often wonder how deep is it across there to take a shortcut. <laughs> That's something to try on the console, say. Which I haven't been on in a while. I'm getting back into my uh, Assassin's Creed. I want to try finish Odyssey and Valhalla this year, because I still have it. They're both on the go. So I'm, I'm nowhere near being ready for Shadow, but that looks cool. Anyway, that's something completely different. Feeling wary. She's not gonna like it when I stick double medium logs on her. remember for the life of me if that repair trailer thing is empty or not. So I wouldn't mind just trying to fix this if I can. Probably done this like five times and it's empty, but I can't remember. It's not, it's not empty. Oh, we could have repaired for ourselves anyway, but yeah, let's, let's do that. We'll try and remember to actually uh, take that up with us as well when the time comes. It's not going to make much difference because I'm going to smack into everything and, and break something in a minute, but... She might appreciate that little tickle.
and off the top of my head, I cannot remember what we've got waiting for us the other side of the tunnel. Probably a massive fuel trailer in the way and something else. Let's see. Don't worry about it in the dark. Oh, it's not too awfully placed, isn't it? It's not bad. We will have some, though. Thank you very much. Now, I think there's another... Another one out there somewhere. Or did we collect it in? We've collected it in. <gasps> oh no. Right, yo. Even less fuel than I thought. I thought we still had a fuel trailer out here somewhere. Have I pulled that fruit? Is that sitting in... Um... It's not, is it? It's not sitting in Drummond. Nope. There's fuel there, and that's it. Oh, man. So we are going to the log station. Oh, it's all going to the log station here. Cement. Let's go, to, oh, let's go to the lumber mill. That's oh, right, which is here. Things will be able to drop a little bit in the way here. It took a nail, didn't it? It took a nail. <laughs> Had a little dip. So what we need to do is actually track the job. It's coming over there. Wait, this comes off and we're like beaving now. Set that back to super order. I 
on this turn. Oh, wait, well, that's one out of the house, I'll remember. I won't, but, you know, we'll pretend I will. While we're here with a crane and a trailer, we might even have a second run at the uh, time to contract here as well. Should be alright. Should be alright. Jiggle there. That's the sort of jiggly glitch that'll pop your load off. And not in a good way. I must have got through that swamp a lot quicker than I, uh, than I thought or it felt like. So we had a fair bit of time this end. And the sun will be coming up soon, I think. But no, I'm wishing the time away. Got lots to do, brother. Almost like trying to thread the needle, but <laughs> that's that massive gap. That's how it feels. Beautiful. Time five. I think we've got time to do this again. I 
four attempts left. Yeah, let's go for it. Let's go for it, mate. I think they should all work under this sort of sense of when you accept it, the pallets you need to deliver spawn. I mean, it can give you a little extra time to do your deliveries, but have a have a like that rather than being able to preload your trailers. Gives us a way of trying to earn a penny on our way back. I am looking forward to finding us a truck that has big, big chunk of tyres. Because even with the jewels, these narrower ones do seem to be hard work. Again, it seems more hard work on hard mode than it does on regular. Those gear changes that slow you down when you try to do anything. They really do grind you sometimes. To a halt. To a literal halt. may end up running over a little bit. I thought we were going to have plenty of time. Without the uh, without the weight, I thought we were going to get back nice and quick. Seems if there's a spot that we can stop at, we will. I believe high range on this is oh no it's pretty quick in it on the white western now we're moving mind the stones mind the tweaks mind the trees mind the dips 
and the highs and the lows. <laughs> Mind everything. Sawmill. Right. Careful on the uh, on the bridges. So it's quite a wide berth coming off. I particularly want to tip the trailer and, and loose the cargo now. Banging and popping. Sounds like someone's doing an airsoft in the woods. I'm sure most people will know what airsoft is. Around the other side. Probably been a bit of a quiet one this one, but we've uh, we've doing quite a few recordings in one day. Get a bit like that sometimes. There we are. So it's a, a bonus free grand for us on that one, since we had to come back that way anyway. Time is, yeah. I did think we were going to overrun a little bit, and we did, but that's absolutely fine, absolutely fine. So, next time out, we will be heading back through. I might, I might pull that fuel trailer through with me as well, not all the way, just, just through to the other side of the gateway, I think, and then we have to deliver in Black River and we have to deliver in Drummond Island so hopefully we'll be able to get those deliveries done next episode if you've enjoyed this one give it a big fat thumbs up down below if you're new to the channel hit the subscribe button turn the bell notification on find out when new videos are going live as always comments and feedback down there you guys have a wonderful day and hopefully I'll see you again very soon bye bye